Hi, this is Trevor, and we buy Utah houses. This house you see behind me is in Magna, Utah, and we just closed on it yesterday. I'm going to do a little walkthrough of what a house might look like before we've done anything, cleaned it out, done any work, or anything like that. So stick with me. I'm going to walk you through the house and show you a little bit about uh, what we expect and, and what you can leave if you sell us your house. It doesn't have to be perfect inside. Let's go. Okay, so the fir first thing is we do not expect you to mow the grass or trim the bushes. Basic yard work is something that can be a hassle before you sell a house and it doesn't have to look perfect. As I walk along the outside here, you'll notice we have a piece of missing siding and that, that piece that's missing is actually inside the garage where if someone was selling their house retail uh, or listed house, you'd probably want to repair that because the appraiser would definitely not like that there's bare wood showing. As I walk around the back of the house, you'll notice the weeds are tall. Uh, the bushes uh, should probably be cut out in some places. But uh, you don't have to do any yard work. You don't have to get rid of garbage that you don't need anymore. So that old swamp cooler has been sitting back here and we'll throw that away. You can see we didn't need the seller of this house to repaint the back door for us. We can take that as is. But again, because that's a raw wood door and it's kind of peeling and flaking off like that, the appraiser would not like the condition of that. This tree is laying on the ground. That branch is broken right there at the, at the stump. All right, let's go back inside. Let's go inside. I have not seen the condition of the inside of the house yet, so this is the first trip for me. You can see we have couches and furniture. And like I said, we don't need you to clean everything up. We can take care of the stuff that doesn't fit in your moving truck. You can see the kitchen is not perfectly clean. In our state, the general rule is that uh, agents want them to be broom swept and free of debris. But as you can see, I don't have a problem cleaning things up that need work. There are some Halloween decorations and some crafting items in here. No problem for us to take care of removing from the property. Also, these walls are very pink. Uh, we will handle the repainting. There are lots of things in this room that just didn't fit in the moving truck. You can even see that it looks like the seller wrapped up this filing cabinet that they wanted to take with them but just didn't have the room so they were able to leave it here. We do like it if you leave clean bathrooms though. Thank you. There are several items in this basement that didn't fit in the moving truck. We have a bed, we have this quilting frame, which can probably be used by someone in the church group. When we make an agreement to buy your house, you can leave everything that you don't want to take with you, that doesn't fit in the truck, or that's just too hard to handle at the moment. We'll clean all that stuff up when we buy the property. It's one of the services that make it worth it for you to sell your house to us instead of somebody else. Call us today and let's see if we can make you an offer that works for you.